for your beautiful bride. She'll hold on to your arm. Actually, she'll hold on to you. Let her arm go under. There you go. You two come on up. Nice and slow. Perfect there. Just stay facing me. Stay facing me the way you are. Okay, take a little step back. Keep holding on to his arm. Take a step back, my love. Here we are. Okay. This is what it's all about. It's about finding your perfect person in this great big world. Welcome and happy wedding day. We're gathered here to celebrate a promise, a promise between two people that deeply love each other. As you know, God has written on every human heart the invitation to love. Thank you both for accepting his very beautiful invitation the day that you met. Love is obviously the reason that we're here. Not only do we say, I love you today, I will love you for all of your tomorrows. Ryan and Rosalind, today your journey has brought you here before each other to declare your love for one another and to promise each other to be there for the next chapter of your lives. Today will mark one of the most celebrated days for the two of you. My wish is that every year on your anniversary that you're able to look back on this very day with true joy, sincere happiness. Remember just how much you loved and how much you supported each other on this, your magnificent day. Now let me take you back in time. Let's go back to the very first memory you have of seeing each other for the first time. Okay, instant smiles, that's my favorite. Okay, <laughs> perfect. Then I'd like you to go to that first date. Try to recall where you went, a little bit of the conversation, but the takeaway here is, I want you to try to never forget how excited you were before that date to see each other again. Gather all of those moments, those memories, place them here. Leave them here as if they were engraved on the tablet of your hearts. Continue to love with all of your hearts. Live with meaning. And always try to be that partner that has room to give, to forgive, and to trust. Always knowing that the person that you're holding on to will still always be your very best friend. Because a true marriage is so much more than just the joining of two persons. What I truly believe is that it is the uniting of two souls that God had predestined to be together. And I truly believe this is the case here. So with all of that said, if I may have your maid of honor step in, would you mind taking the bouquet? She's going to hand it to you. Perfect. Thank you. And you can have a seat. Thank you. No, not quite yet. I'll get those in a minute. <laughs> Couldn't face each other because I know he's dying to look at you. Hold hands. Ah. Ryan, you just get lost in those gorgeous eyes. I'm going to ask you first if you take this wonderful soul standing before you, Rosalind, to be your bride, your best friend, to be your wife. Do you promise to love, honor, and cherish her all the days of your life? I do. <laughs> And Rosalind, do you take this handsome gentleman standing before you to be your best friend, your protector, and your husband? Do you promise to love, honor, and cherish Ryan all the days of your life? I do. Beautiful. <laughs> now, I love it when, when couples write their own vows because um, they're just so special. And at this moment, I'm going to hand you yours and say, keep holding one hand if you like. Shall I leave this with you just in case? <coughs> All right, you go right ahead. Rosalind, I just want to start by saying that I love you so much, and you look unbelievable. <laughs> Obviously, I'm a very lucky man. You're the most beautiful person I have ever known. From your glowing personality to your gorgeous smile, you're one of a kind. You can make me laugh on my worst days and make me a million times happier on my best days. I will never forget first seeing you on our first date. 
I had never been so excited to just meet and get to know someone. And I was obviously correct to be excited because I met my wife. I met my best friend, my caretaker, my lover, my person, and the love of my life. Rosalind Deshay, I promise to always be the man you deserve. I promise to always be faithful to you, to hold you when you're sad, to protect you, to care for you in sickness and in health. And most importantly, I promise to always love you through thick and thin. As long as I'm breathing and walking this earth, you'll be treated like the absolute queen that you are. I am honored to be your husband, and I will spend our eternity loving you and enjoying life to the absolute fullest with you. I love you, honey, with all my heart. Hey, okay, don't kiss her yet. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Jesus, you can hold one of his hands if you like. Go right ahead. Aww. Hey, I almost said you make up. <laughs> In an instant, you changed my life. You showed me, someone who never really experienced love, what love was supposed to be like. The day we met, we connected on a level out of this world. A connection so deep that even our souls could tell. You came in and swept me off my feet, and you have proven to me that you love me for me, for me who I am naturally. And for that, I promise to you that I will always be true to you. I promise to love you, and that love will never fade. I promise, Brian, that I will wear your ring, I will hold your hand, and I will stand tall with you through the good and the bad, the thick and the thin. You are my everything, as we always say. Mm -hmm. You are always going to be my everything. I love you so much. I love Aww. you so much, too. Perfect, you too. Keep all the yes. <laughs> Now you understand we have some rings. Come on. <laughs> Thank you so much. Perfect. And you two keep holding hands. Okay. But let's look here at the rings. Gorgeous. When we look at the rings, we can see that they're formed in a perfect round circle with no beginning, but more importantly, no end, as God intended it. When we place your wedding bands together in this fashion, it formed the sign of infinity, a beautiful word that also means for a lifetime. May these rings always be that reminder to each of you that someone else carries your heart and they love you just as much as you love them. I'm going to hand you Rasmus rings. As you recall, the band will go first, as it'll go closest to her heart, and then the engagement. And here's her left hand. Take your time. Get used to that. <laughs> <laughs> I have a ring for you, darling. His hand is here. And you know, before you place the ring, I'm going to ask you to place your love in the ring. He'll wear it for the rest of his life. And then go ahead and place the ring on him. You're fine. There we go. Perfect. Now let's take a look at your rings. You two go ahead and face this way here. Okay. And then put your hand, hold on to his arm. Hold on to his arm, put your hand on top of his hand. And let's look at your rings. These are the first gifts that you give each other on your wedding day. May you always treasure your rings, like a treasure your marriage, and like you'll treasure this day, this very moment. Come together here to the Unity Candle. Keep holding on. Yeah. And just face me. Now before you, we have three candles. The two outer candles that are lit, they represent the two of you and your personal journeys before your wedding day. 
The center candle represents your beautiful and your bright future together and the two of you becoming one today. So I'm going to ask, go ahead and place your arm around her waist. She'll place hers around yours. I'm going to hand you your candle because it might be a little harder to pull out. Perfect. And you may place those back. And we're going to head to this camera. So I'm going to ask the two of you to just come with me here. No, dress is okay. Let's come together real quick. Stand here, closer to me, Ryan. Okay, let's face this camera. Put your arm around your bride's waist. <laughs> and let's head out and say hello to family and friends. <laughs> Go ahead, say whatever you hey, like. <laughs> <laughs> we love y'all. Thank love you all you guys. for watching. Thanks for watching. We're sorry you couldn't be here, everybody that couldn't come, but we're glad that you were able to see us today. Okay. Let's send them a little love from uh, Las Vegas, right? Send them a little <laughs> love. There you go. And then come on back, face each other, and hold hands. Stand right on that heart and face him. And then you go ahead and hold hands with her. Face each other and hold hands. Yep. As you continue to walk down the path of life on days that seem dark or light, May you always turn to each other in times of sorrow or joy. Lean on each other as you enter new beginnings and continue to share all of God's promises with each other. It is truly now my great honor to pronounce you as husband and wife. You may seal your promises with a kiss. <laughs> Present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Woods, sir. Walk your beautiful bride down the aisle. Cheers! <laughs>